Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Nesso, and today we're going to be looking at kind of a fun tage of CSGO stuff. So this is just a disclaimer real quick, just to let you know that when I was actually recording this, I was watching a replay to download. Um, so that's why you might see all the outlines and stuff in it went up. But uh, yeah, let's get right into it. So first clip, let's see, what are we doing? Got the match start, hoping for a good thing, and you know... Just, just chilling there, hoping. Oh, okay, we're gonna peek down mid, and obviously don't see nobody. So, what could be the big issue? Oh, well, apparently that didn't do much, but yeah, let's uh, throw in here. We're gonna be jumping, and oh god, what? Oh my god, there was a complete rush havoc, and oh, I'm um, apparently upside down, because you know, fighting while I'm upside down like that is always the best. Now in this clip, like I said, I mentioned before that the blue things or the outlining of it was unintentional, but however, as you can see, that I shoot hoping that they're not there. And when I was actually watching this, I completely thought that... Was it this one? I don't remember if it was this one or not. Oh, no, I think it wasn't this one. Maybe, perhaps, I don't know, we'll see. Okay, well, I see that guy, and apparently I do not because he's right there and shoots me. Hey, buddy, what's up? Love you, buddy. Love you, too. <laughs> Alright, well, coming to my bad CSGO plane, I'm usually crap. But as you see, this guy comes and just, bah! He's down for the count. Now, I think I can handle everybody at this point. At this point, I'm thinking, why not? I am the best CSGO player in the world. And then I turn the corner. And apparently can't hit this guy with no matter how many bullets I try hitting him with. So, uh, yeah, let's try it for a second time. Nothing could get worse than this. Oh, he's planning, and I'm looking, I don't see anybody yet, I'm going to completely die and complete shit. Alright, so apparently I don't have a gun, and I'm looking for this gun. Now, I do pick it up, trying to go up the stairs, and apparently I see him and don't shoot, and he shoots me, obviously. Alright, so at this point, my teammate gets killed. He's running back, hoping for something good, you know, trying to play passive, trying to keep sight down, and doesn't look like anything's going to be coming up anytime soon. So I decide to rush down and see these guys and don't spray until the end and I'm dead. Again. Well, the Bison. Bison is a good gun. I really do like the Bison. It's really great. It's really nice when you can hit headshots. But isn't that great at all when you don't know how to play? So the smoke goes out. Pretending that I hope I know what I'm doing. Hide behind the bags and as you can see the yellow people in the back are somewhere down banana now being a gold nova 2 I recently just got drained from gold nova 3 unfortunately being gold nova 2 you should always know how to check your corners that flashbang was really good but obviously I don't check corners okay so at this point I'm thinking to myself what else could go wrong I don't even know what I have at this point I forgot what I have oh so this guy tells us to follow him. This guy the whole match was messing about. Trying, uh, knifing people, trying to use people. And, let's see. Okay, so I have a Glock. Apparently I don't have much of a gun. I think I can make a smart idea of looking at this guy and trying to shoot him. Yet, I light him up and get tagged and die to somebody else. Of course, apparently I have some type of... I don't know. Some fucking... Alright, so... Usually peeking over this is something really good to do because you can see who's inside balcony from that little window Probably tap him in the head and Get the kill or if not tag him really bad so your teammate can just rush in and go in But I decided to make the smart move of trying to get up this hay barrel, which apparently I can't do either I'm not spider-man so trying to jump Yeah, there you go knife out trying to jump and I fail completely only to know that my teammate is right behind me and I mean of course checking dark is usually something good, but I get the kill so that is good check dark just to make sure that nobody's around me. And I'm pretty much going to mess everything up like I usually do. Let's see. So, I see the guy on my screen. There he is, and don't register till late. I can't even hit the headshot. And what do you know, I die. Now at this point, I think running with an AK up B is usually a good idea. If this guy gets a clap through the wall. Checking coordinates is always perfect, of course, on Inferno. And again, I see the guy, but don't shoot my gun! At this point, I think I should just bring out the op, because the op is great, the op is love. And you know what, I may have just toggled, yet I don't use hacks, but let's see, 
ladies and gentlemen. Let's get something really good out because this guy, apparently I can see through the smoke. I was just doing a random shot just in case anybody would peek. But now, this is where the FaZe Clan, Optic Nation, Fnatic, Kenny S comes in. My awesome stuff. Trust me, I am not hacking. I had this on, but of course with the blue little outlines I see. Headphones is what makes everything great because you can hear everything. Look, just hear the footsteps. Can you hear the footsteps? I can't hear the footsteps. Well, apparently I actually can hear the footsteps and I take a look and there's two guys right there. One, oh my God, how did I do that too? I'm surely gonna die. No, I win. Oh my God. So far I have a three piece with an op and I usually suck with the op. I can't hit any shot with the op like that. Of course, checking Mexico is one of the best things to do because who else would be hiding there? Yet my teammate's right there and I hear a scout. Might as well get the kill before my teammate does. So peeking through the corner and bam, round over, I win, goodbye. Thank you.